Hello everyone and welcome to TCG Card Shop Simulator. Now I think the name pretty much says everything that we need to know about this game, but I'll go into a little bit more detail. We're going to open our own TCG Card Shop and we're going to be selling cards and all of the related accessories. We're going to have some tables where people can come and play a game or two and we're going to get started right away. So first thing we need to do is of course name our shop let's see i quit my day job to open my own card game store this is it time to get down to business and as i said first thing we need to do is name our shop so let's see we need something that's going to lure the people in something that's going to make them believe that this is going to be a great time for them and i think we need something a little bit superhero theme so let's go for super draws Actually, that just sounds like a place that Spider-Man buys his underwear. Um, let's go for something a little bit more on the nose. We'll call our shop Sick Pools. Awesome. And we're done. Confirm shop name. Of course, I'm going to confirm that. And Sick Pools is not open for business. As you can see, we're still closed because if we take a peek inside, yeah, absolutely nothing happening. So the first thing we need to do is, of course, get a little bit of stock. And for that, we have an app. Let's take a look over here now. The only thing we can buy at the moment is the base standard card pack. And we're going to get straight into it. I think I'm going to order about four of those. I've got $1,000. Now, this is the thing that puzzles me. I hope that's $1,000 of saving. And secondly, if that's all we have, I don't know how great an idea it is to quit your day job with only a thousand dollars and open a game store but i'm not here to judge we're gonna give it a bash add to cart let's go live our dream purchase and the great thing is we've got instant delivery just look at that everything has already arrived and it's time to get stacking just gonna pop these onto the shelf any day now and then i'm gonna throw this box here because boxes are actually quite handy i didn't realize that the first time i tried to play the game and i ended up with a bit of a problem so set price now we've got two strategies the first is to go market price plus 10 and then we're going to try and draw them in with volume now for around that it takes it to three dollars let's just see if i go plus 20 it takes it to 337 and that runs down to three dollars anyway so let's just have a quick look yeah if we do that we're pretty much selling it for just under 10 percent so i think we need to go roughly let's go for three dollars fifty uh, that's not a lot of profit but as i said we're going to try and go for some volume uh, i think 350 is round enough and we're going to set the price at that see how that goes for us anyway let's grab the rest of these packs let's get our shelves stocked and then oh, let's get selling and we've got our last box on the shelves our shelves are stocked we're ready to get going and that looks a little bit sad an entire shop and that's the stock we've got but let's get going you know Rome wasn't built in a day and we all have to start so may so yes ladies and gentlemen we are open for business come on in come check out our wares well our wear We've only got one at the moment, but look, we've got the people coming in already. Let's see. So the other great thing about this game is, of course, that I can open some of these packs myself and we can check out all of the awesome cards and perhaps get some really rare ones which go for a ton of cash so let's get started first pack opening and our first card 30 cents amazing 20 cents eight cents eh, it's not getting any better is it oh one dollar 98 okay we've got our first sort of rare card i suppose Let's get the second pack open. I'm just going to do two for now, and I suppose I need to go check these people out. So let's just get this one done. And nothing much in that pack. Anyway, let's get these good people checked out. Three packs for you. Thank you, sir. And $9.50 in change. Ah. 
I might need to reconsider the price on these. I think let's go market price 10 rounded and we'll just go for the $3 and see if that brings in more people. See if they are buying more stuff. While we're waiting for someone to arrive, I'm just going to sneak one more pack over here. Let's see. Give me a big one. I can do with a boost right about now. I know I've just started, but um, yeah, things aren't going great. Ooh, that's not too bad. $3.86. $2.73. Hey, that wasn't a bad pack at all. Anyway, we've got a customer, so let's see. Wow, got to take one of these. Okay, obviously, they like this price a lot better. I mean, it's 50 cents different, so come on, dude, seriously. But it's going to make it a lot easier for me to do the cash register, especially when it's just a round number. Anyway, let's get this dude checked out. Paying with a plastic, I see $27. Have a great day. almost sold out i almost have to reorder and we're already up on what we started with look at that we've got a thousand and ten dollars but i think we need to order a few more packs i'm gonna get four more and then let's get this checked out and go grab our merchandise and our shelves are stocked once again then i'll just drop that there Grab two of these and let's see if we get a sick draw right here at the beginning. 12 cent, 18, 55, 2 cents, 22, 17, 9, and that pack sucked. Maybe we'll have better luck with this one. Nope, nope. Yeah, not too bad, not too bad. $1.19, 4 cents, 21 cents, 18, 17. Okay, not much to write home about in those, but we've got some customers, so let's take care of them. Have a great day, sir. Oh, there we go, $16.71. Seppoling, and it's an EX. Uh, I have no idea what that means. Anybody knows, let me know in the comments down below, because I have absolutely no clue. I see pretty pictures, I see big numbers, and I get excited. So here we go. Yeah, just the one over there. Not bad, not bad at all. Oh, dude. All right, let's get you checked out. You could just ask me for a box. But anyway, thank you, sir. $84. Have a fantastic day. And you're back again, and yeah, this time you grabbing all of them. I assume you've got an absolute awesome card in the last bunch. So you're back for more, aren't you? There we go. Have a great day. Let's turn on the lights. And at this speed, we're going to have to restock a second time today. But right now, I think we've still got a few uh, cards here so let's just grab two of these and see if we can get some luck on our side not much to write home about in that pack let's see what this one has to offer one dollar and absolute rubbish for the rest have a great day thank you have a great evening and we are done which means we can finally close the shop for the night and since we have done a quite a bit of business i'm going to grab a handful of these and we're gonna rip them open let's see what we get Ooh, 530 that's not a bad one all righty that's it. We are done for the night. I think I'm just going to reorder some stuff. Maybe get my new furniture in here and then get everything set up so we're ready when we open tomorrow. So let's hit that. Ah, I forgot. I need to pay bills. Anyway, right now all of our bills are paid. So uh, we're right for now. That means we can just go in here. I think we're going to need about... Judging by 
what we did today. We're going to need about eight of those. Oh, that is expensive. Anyway, we need it, so let's get it. And then accessories. Let's see. Oh, we're definitely going to need some of this. As soon as those stinky people start arriving, we desperately going to need these. So let's just buy that. And then I think we can go and check out my DIY. Card table, $400. Oh, that is pretty pricey. Play table, okay. I think I would rather have a play table or two. Let's put up two. And then we will get the card stand tomorrow. So let's just get our play table set up. And then tomorrow all the guys can come in. They can come and have some fun, play some card games. And of course, we will get some money from that as well. So let's just set this one up right there. And then we'll grab the next one. And I think we're just going to set that one up. Uh, let's, see, let's see. Let's see. I think I'm going to put it over here. Right in that corner over there. And that means we can set up a few shelves over here. Or maybe one shelf over there. One shelf over there with a card table in the middle or something like that. Or maybe have the card table right in the middle of the store. I'm not 100% sure how I want to lay this out just yet. But... We'll get to that when we get the actual display table for the cards. Right now, we've got two tables where they can come and play. We've got the cards that they can buy. And that's it. Close that up. And we'll just pop that down right there. I just want to move this because it's standing uh, out in the middle of the shop at the moment. Let's just move that up against the wall. That's a lot better. And then let's get these inside. And once that's done, we can close for the night. All right, 30 total visitors, 30 checkouts, one dissatisfied customer. I'm not sure exactly what they're upset with, but anyway, 30 items bought. And we have sold 225 packs of cards already. That is an absolute ton. Three levels, $688 from the cards. However, our profit is way way down and that's because we bought two tables and a bunch of stock but we're gonna make it up in day two here we go all right it's day two we are ready we can open up we've stocked all of the stuff yesterday already we've got our two tables in here so people can come and play some games and if we make enough profit today we're gonna be buying display table over here for all of our rare and valuable cards and we're gonna get some more tables in here as well as another shelf or two of course and let's hope business is picking up soon. Yeah, here they come. I already see Mr. Stinky over there. I'm going to get ready to greet him as soon as he sets foot in here. Yeah, there we go. There we go. That's what you get. No stinkies in my shop, bro. Anyway, put that back up there and let's check you out, sir. Have a great day. Thank you very much. How's it going, guys? Having a good game here? Yeah, yeah, you know, you're actually the first people to play in this shop. I'm gonna get a plaque, put it on the wall over there, commemorating you guys. And the last of the big spenders. One whole pack for you, sir, and then you give me a freaking $20 bill. $17 change, have a great day. And while there's a bit of a lull, let's sneak one for ourselves. It's gonna be a good one, I feel it in my bones and that's a great start. $4, not bad, not bad. Okay, I'll, I'll go with that, $4, it's worth more than I'm selling the cards for at the moment, so that is not bad at all. Anyway, yes sir, that's what I like to see, dedicated customers dedicated patrons of the arts $18 in change and you'll be having four of those have a great day we got a code stink we got a code stink let's get rid of code stink over here sir you smell whoever buys that bottle is going to be sorely disappointed anyway let's get you checked out and once again, we've got a little bit of time, so let's just rip open this pack before that guy gets to the checkout. And let's see anything fantastic that we've got here. 
Holy crap! Holy crap! That is insane. Five hundred dollars. Holy crap. Okay. That is absolutely phenomenal. It's day two and we just got an absolute blinder. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. Six dollars for you. Yeah, you guys see. You guys see what I just pulled there. It came from those cards right there on the shelf. Grab yourself some. You could be the next one to get something like that. Anyway, let's stock this up because people have been buying these things like hotcakes. Here we go. Come on, come on. Get yourself cleaned up, jeez. You want it. Awesome stuff. Uh, go, ma'am. Have a good game. Did you beat him? Two packs. We'll see how many he buys and then we'll know. And you, sir. Ah, two packs as well. I suppose it was pretty much a draw. Yeah, you've got some deodorant. You needed some, bro. Just make sure next time you come in through those doors, you smell better. All right. We'll let it slide this time, but next time, there's going to be trouble. Anyway, have a great day. And that's time for us. Let's close that. And then I think it's time to take care of business. Now, the first thing we need is the display table, the card table. Let's see. Small card display. I think that's our only option right now. So let's grab that $400. Oh, and then I need to need. OK, I can get the 64 license that I think that just I'm not sure if it works out. It's same unit price, but I think the delivery is a little bit less on that one. So add a few of those. Add that to our cart and. Um, temporary expectations there okay shelves are restocked let's grab the table and oh geez it's a big one and i'm gonna put it right there so people have to walk around it and they're gonna be able to see all of the awesome cards on it and they're gonna want them so they're gonna buy them and i have got an absolute blinder to sell uh, is that in the middle that's not in the middle that better yeah, it's all right okay so i think that's looking pretty decent let's pop some cards on there and then we can go to day three ah, i still need ah oh, look at that absolutely phenomenal as i said i still need to get some deodorant because all of the smelly people have bought it all and um yeah we'll grab we'll grab some of that now Oh, look at that. If we can sell that card, we're going to be in the pound seats. Now, I know I probably should keep all of my awesome cards for now until I get some duplicates. But let's be honest, we're going to be opening tons more packs. We're going to have a lot of chances to get some awesome cards. And I think I'm going to sell them for now. Get some money in here. Get the shop all spruced up. And then... Let's get ourselves a few cards as a reward. No, not that. One hand full of cards and here we go. Let's get opening. Oh, full art. Awesome. That looks brilliant. And $54. Okay, so one awesome card, a few $5, a few that is a little bit more valuable, but overall, nothing as phenomenal as our absolute masterpiece over there. Just look at it. Brilliant. Anyway, I'm going to leave this episode here for now. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. Leave a like if you did, and if you want to see some more, be sure to hit that subscribe button. But this is Fungosaurus Rex saying, until next time, beautiful people, stay awesome. Bye-bye.